Hello everyone, my name is Takamasa Arai, Solution Application Engineer from Keysight Technologies. Today, I'd like to talk to you about accurate dynamic characterization of gallium nitride power semiconductor devices. GAN power devices are becoming popular in power electronics applications because of their low energy loss and high power density capability but engineers are still struggling to evaluate their dynamic characteristics. Due to the fast switching feature of the GAN devices, parasitic inductance in the test circuit easily causes huge ringing or oscillation of the device, sometimes leading to device destruction. That makes the dynamic test of GAN devices really difficult. Dynamic on-state resistance RDS on is also important because engineers are still concerned about the current collapse phenomenon of the GAN devices. But the evaluation of a dynamic RDS on was also challenging. Keysight has already had a dynamic RDS on measurement solution in our power device analyzer B1505A, but it can only measure RDS on after tens of microseconds from turn on. The speed was not enough for the GAN devices used in high-frequency switching applications, so people are waiting for a better solution. In the following slides, I'm going to show you how we've overcome these challenges. Keysight released PD1500A Dynamic Power Device Analyzer Double Pass Tester in 2019 which provides the turnkey solution with repeatable, reliable, and accurate measurement based on a unique compensation technology. And we created the GAN device test solution in 2020. We are also planning to release dynamic testers for power modules in the future. Here is the brief overview of a GAN device test solution which solved the issues I mentioned earlier. First of all, we provide customized test boards for each GAN device, which integrates all necessary components in one board while keeping modularity. This architecture minimizes parasitic inductance and provides an ideal testing environment. Secondly, we develop new technologies which we call repeatable and reliable GAN characterization R-square GC technologies. One is the low insertion inductance current sensor. This minimizes the power loop inductance of the test circuit. Another is the solderless contact technology for both DUTs and gate resistors, which makes it much easier to test multiple samples under multiple RG conditions. We also developed a clamp circuit to evaluate dynamic RDS on within hundreds of nanosecs after the switch event. This slide shows how our newly developed column sensor improved the quality of the test waveform. These are the test results of a gallium nitride gate injection transistor. The results on the left are taken with existing technologies. The upper one uses a commercially available coaxial shunt resistor. The lower one uses an existing current transformer, CT, which has the highest bandwidth in the market. The result with the coaxial shunt shows huge ringing in the IDS waveform. This indicates the effect of insertion inductance of the shunt. The result with the CT shows slower ringing in the IDS waveform and more VDS drop at turn on, which indicates there was more insertion inductance. The bandwidth of the CT also looks narrower by looking at the filtered appearance of the IDS waveform. On the other hand, the result of our new sensor on the right shows a sharp onset of ideas, showing the high bandwidth 
of our R square GC current sensor. The result also shows less ringing and small VDS drop, proving the small insertion inductance of our new sensor. We also developed solderless contact technology for both DUTs and gate resistors. Since most of the GAN devices are provided as surface mount packages, we basically need to solder and unsolder the DUTs to test multiple samples. But it takes time and eventually wears out the test board. That's why we developed this new technology, R Square GC Solderless Conduct. These are the pictures of the R Square GC Solderless Conduct. As shown in these pictures, a special electrode is formed directly on the board, and we can make good contact between the electrode and the DUTs with a few milliohms or less by putting pressure from the top side of the DUT. The pictures on the center compare the test waveforms between the soldered board and the solderless contact board. We didn't see any degradation in the test waveform. In addition, you can perform the temperature measurement very easily by attaching the heater with the DUT. Gate resistors are also replaceable without soldering, which makes the dynamic testing under multiple RG conditions much easier. And here is how dynamic RDSM measurement was improved with a newly developed R square GC clamp circuit. A clamp circuit is necessary for RDSM measurement in order not to overdrive the oscilloscope. One of the most important characteristics of the clamp circuit is response time. This graph shows the dynamic RDSM test results of a GAN device taken with the R square GC clamp circuit in PD1500A and our previous solution B1505A. As this graph shows, the response time of the B1505A was about tens of microsec. On the other hand, the newly developed clamp circuit has about 50 nanosec of response time, approximately 1000 times faster than the previous solution. It is fast enough for most GAN applications. As you can see, the R square GC clamp circuit successfully detected an increase in RDS on within several hundred nanosec from turn on. This is a test example of a gallium nitride gate injection transistor. As the result shows, you can get the switching waveform with high frequency bandwidth and less ringing. And here is the test result of a GAN e -hemmed. We also got good results with HEMT devices. And here is a test result of a cascode GAN transistor. We have already created test boards for most GAN transistor types like GIT, HEMT, and Cascode. Our system also gives you the gate charge measurement capability for GAN devices, which was difficult with our previous solutions like B1505A and 6A. As shown in the graph on the right, you can get QG parameters less than 10 nanocoulomb. Here is the summary. Keysight developed a dynamic test solution for GAN devices, which comes with a newly developed low insertion inductance current sensor, solderless contact technology, and a clamp circuit. We provide unprecedentedly repeatable, reliable, and efficient measurement environment. If you are working on dynamic testing of GAN devices and find it difficult to do it, please contact Keysight. We'll provide the best solutions to you. Thanks for listening.